Hello my dear friends, this tutorial will show the easiest and fastest way to update Radio Master Pocket and TX16S Internal Express LRS module based on the pass-through method. In the first step, it is required to install Express LRS Configurator. It is very easy, go to your browser and type Express LRS Configurator. Select the second option from the GitHub and here you have the possibility to install for the Windows, macOS and Linux. We will choose the first option, Windows, and there you have the version of the ExpressLRS configurator. Let's download it. ExpressLRS Configurator allows you to build, compile and flash firmware for the transmitter modules, like in our case, but also for the ExpressLRS receivers. Now, install this software component on your computer. The installation is finished, now we can go to the second step. Now we need to connect the transmitter to the PC and configure the transmitter to be able to be updated by the Express LRS configurator. For this use an USB-C cable and use the upper connector. In the end, select the USB serial option on your screen. For the Radio Master Pocket is the same. Keep in mind that the button connector is used only to recharge the internal batteries for both transmitters. In the same mode, select USB serial in order to be able to flash your transmitter. Now we start the main part, flashing the latest Express LRS version to your transmitter. Here, please do not use the pre-release version. And under releases, choose the latest firmware. Under the device target, select the brand and the device. In this case, I have Radio Master Pocket connected. So, I will choose Radio Master. Both stations work on 2.4 GHz. The difference came with the device. Here I can select Radio Master Pocket or or Radio Master TX16S. But we select right now Pocket. Be sure that the HTX pass through is selected. I do not use a bind trace, but if you use it, please select it now. In the end, select Erase before flash and click on the flash button. Now the building process has started. You can also see that the station was detected on port 7. You can find more information regarding the different configuration options in the video description. At this moment, you can see that the connection was established and the writing process was started. Now, the writing process was ended successfully. In the end, save the LOA script. 
you can configure the Express LRS system based on this raw script, such as changing the radio link settings, activating binding mode, enabling Wi-Fi and so on. The station must be configured before saving the Lua script to the station. The process is the same as the previous one. First, connect a USB cable. And then select the USB storage mode. The process for the Radio Master Pocket is the same as the one for the Radio Master TX16S. If you configure the station correctly, a new window will open with all the files from the internal memory. The place where you must save the Lua script file is Scripts and from here select Tools. To be sure, delete all the previously existing files. Now find the place where you saved the Lua script and copy this file to the station. Now you have finished the entire updating process. Да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да-да